Hello and welcome back to another episode of XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. This is the Flawless Run and my name is Saiken. Flawless Run as in we're trying to beat the game Zero Death, Zero Lost Missions and trying to flawless as much as possible. Uh, time for uh, the Eastern US Operation First Him, hacking a workstation and getting Dr. Amy Carroll on board. So what we don't want to do is... Uh, misuse our already tired operatives and <coughs> hence the question is do we want to go in with this team or do we feel like uh, upgrading another soldier to a specialist specialists are rising quickly in the ranks which is um, oftentimes quite helpful for us um, in order to just get that extra level or two we could exchange uh, inappropriate Murphy for a rookie. And we got uh, quite a few uh, rookies here. How about we're using one of the newcomers? Uh, 8515 is an, a freshly drafted one. Paul Holroy uh, wanted to be in a campaign. You are drafted, my friend, and you're going to be the specialist, so why not? Um, in terms of just weapons, uh, give him the assault rifle, and there you go. Double grenade for Roro, give him the DLC weapon. In case you're wondering if you're uh, playing through the DLC, then these weapons for gold medalists will be in the game. So they are not modded or anything. Just a little bit of a throwback to uh, to the original campaign. Good. So that's our team. That's what we want to do. All we need to do is hack a workstation. And that should be well within our means. It's an easy mission. So eight-ish enemies uh, there. No chosen yet. And straight up uh, going for uh, the, uh, the next engineer. So let's go. All right, so we landed. What is happening? Good. We need to get there. Only seven turns. So our biggest and best weapon for that is going to be the Reaper. Because the Reaper can easily push forward. And spot enemies out. There we go. All right, 8-5. Moves up as well. And Enders moves up. Double move at the beginning is helpful. Okay, that's a bit of a bummer because these guys have moved away from us instead to us. I will be in position. Double checking what we're dealing with. The patrol is coming. Okay, so there is another patrol. We could use our claymore now, but this is a very easy pack and that would feel wasted. Moving on target location. Let's pull them. Got em. We've been spotted. Even though we're standing in the open. In Enders moves up. Let's not trigger another pack. Removes cover here, deals at least three points of damage. Actually kills them. All right, never mind. I go where you tell me. And we need to move closer. This high ground here would look great, but I don't think that we can actually get there. The fire 
means we would need to move around and then there is no real cover here so sometimes something looks good on paper but in reality it just doesn't play out that way instead what we can do is use a claymore and just get these guys down in order to do that i would want to position without triggering them yet still got enough time overwatch overwatch and they should not necessarily move problem is for not seeing them from up here good so wh where are they one is here one is here so that's one two and the sector Okay, so one here, one there. Just looking at the fields that are, and one here, okay. By looking at the fields that are taken, one here, one there, okay, so that's a good one. There we go. Problem solved. Moving to designated coordinates. Move forward. Remove cover. Bombs away. Move forward, take a shot, there we go, oh, that's my boy, moves forward, finishes him. Good, one more pack, we still got one more grenade as well, so we should be good. Moving over there. Without finding anything, huh? that is strange. Maybe the last pack is inside. I am at your service. I found their protection. All right, last pack found. Good. Moving up, Laren Core isn't bad as uh, a start. Roll, roll. Moves up as well, and eight five. Could take the high ground here. All right, we know it's just one more pack. Positioning ourselves in advantageous positions. All right, enemies have spotted us out. Fair enough. That's affirmative. Move up. Remove all of the cover, maybe even kill one of them. Hmm, 
where is that last guy? I'm wondering why he hasn't taken any damage. Well, he has, but did not die immediately. Good, we can't kill the sector right away. Might as well make sure that uh, we are going to be okay. Enemy protocol is a fantastic uh, option. <laughs> and we really get it. Oh my lord. Well, we now got a hacker reaper. Unfortunately, the guy with uh, the uh, with the um, grenade is being mind controlled. That is very unfortunate. Now we don't have any more grenades left over. Going into shadow, I increase our movement range. Uh, we want the high ground here. That's a good first uh, hit. Very nice. And we're not even revealed. Perfect. And that is hopefully the kill and the end of the problem. There we go. Very nice. Very nice. So, we got ourselves another engineer. Quick mission. And we got plenty of promotions. So, as always, you get one of each class at the beginning, and uh, A5 will be our specialist in this run. Specialist highly underutilized and undervalued class, so uh, we're going to see a bit of them here. In the meantime, Blade Master Phantom is also good. Shouldn't underestimate that. We now have remote start, which is great. And is there anyone? All right, perfect. We got our first bond going. Not bad. Commander, I've updated our current objectives based on the most recent findings. Good. Another engineer, which uh, means we can continue excavating. I'm just going to be greedy here and start full excavation. The GTS itself. You know what? Uh, we get one more mission and then we got the terror mission. And if we go into the terror mission with five, that would not be too bad. So let's start building the GTS a bit faster. Commander, we have a lead on the alien black site, but we'll have to rely on the local resistance. We don't need more rookies at this point. I would rather go for the supplies uh, because if we need a SWAT side up, uh, SWAT size upgrade, uh, then supplies are coming in very handy. Good, bring it on. Fantastic. That's the mission I was looking for. I tell you what, uh, we're just going to uh, we're just going to do this mission uh, because it's only ten minutes into the episode. Uh, get a scientist, get a specialist, get a lot of intel. That is really good. Another specialist isn't bad. The scientist is fantastic because it speeds up our research. 
We're detecting lost activity in this area. Our forces will need to be especially vigilant. Good, and you know, this time we're not going... Hmm. Hmm. I shouldn't say that. Um, I, I was about to say we're not going in with uh, ghosts because I want to... I want to keep her mental fortitude uh, steady for the uh, for the for the actual terror mission that is going to come up. This is an easy mission, but the high-ranking soldiers also need to get more experience. So Roro is out uh, for this one, and we're going to put in inappropriate Murphy. There is an advantage in doing that. Inappropriate Murphy has a pistol and with a pistol uh, we have a no ammunition option uh, to gun down all of uh, the loss. So in a, in a high ground position that's actually quite helpful. Good. And all of this here does not look too bad. We just need to give them the right weapons and then we're ready to go. Get another specialist and get a scientist. So it's essentially saving, saving them uh, from, uh, from a convoy type of mission. And we're going to do that right away. Good, first time that we're going to fight against the Lost. I'm still trying to put as much experience as possible onto our higher level soldiers. And the VIP is using a remote turret to hold off the Lost. We only have one clear access point. Good, we need to get uh, to this uh, to this guy and we also need to recover uh, the other soldier. Don't bother trying to outgun them. After you secure the expedition, you'll have to return to our original entry point for extraction. Don't get overrun. Keep the path back to Firebrand clear. Step it off. <coughs> Very seldomly in these missions, the Chosen appears, but that's rather rare. It appears the alien devices dropped during the first invasion had a degenerative effect on these citizens, causing their physical and mental health to rapidly decay while maintaining primitive organic functions. Approach with caution, Commander. They are certainly dangerous. They certainly are. Good, there's a timer, but the timer doesn't really mean a whole lot. Oh, I, uh, I just lost concealment, that was stupid. More losts. Uh, we're going to lose concealment soon anyways, but might as well move in, spot them out, lots of them here, and move up. Okay, cool. So our plan will be to move all the way over there. Good. Very good. Blocking the ladder. And we're going to take all of them down.
moving over because we need to get to that other balcony. Finally in a good position over here. And in the meantime, we are moving over. More swarms will come in the moment that we're getting closer here. As in next turn that will happen. Lost themselves are not necessarily scary. We can deal with them. The turret just ran dry of ammo. They've got nothing to hold back the loss now. Menace one five, get to their position on the double. Target neutralized. Gonna need a reload soon. It's down. Back online. No rounds. <coughs> Good. More removal of loss. And they, funnily enough, even give a small fraction of, um, of experience. The VIP is secure, Commander. If we can spare the manpower, we should try to bring the escort in as well. Sure. Without the VIP manning the turret controls, there's nothing keeping the lost from overrunning this area. They're already closing in. Yeah, sure. Look. Uh, carry the unit that will... Moving as ordered. ...force us to move a bit closer. And... Well, let's just get the dashers down, shall we? Enemies down. Ready to engage. Good. More Overwatch. Lots more Overwatch, and we're just sprinting away. Another lost swarm appears. All we need to do is run, 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 run. Oh, unfortunate. But they're not fast enough to immediately hurt us. And we're safe on the balcony, so I'm actually okay with where everything is at. Firebrand is in position. Get back to the entry point for extraction before you get overrun. We're picking up more heat signatures than the sensors can keep up with. Kill confirmed. We use some ammo over here. Good. Luckily, we do have a sniper. And luckily, inappropriate Murphy does actually shoot very well. Overwatch is reload, Overwatch, reload, Overwatch.
Good, all we need to do is get uh, two over there. More losses will be coming in, but they are very far away, and all we uh, all we need to do at this time is kill the dashers and then just run. Can't even see them. That's a long run. Uh, that should not reveal anything new. I hope we're okay. Yes, we are. Which means you can run, and that means you can run, and that means uh, you can run. That definitely also means you can run. Yeah, they are far, far away from us. All right, get out of here. Move, move, move. And move. I leave the field for now. We've recovered the VIP's escort. We'll get her patched up and ready to redeploy into the field. Good. Easy enough mission. If you only fight against the loss and you know how to use ladders and overlapping fields of fire, there is nothing that they can do. Could have in a perfect world, but I wouldn't want to do that now. In a perfect world, I could have just uh, grinded in order to get uh, more kills. And just yeah, killed a hundred lost. But uh, that doesn't make for very attractive gameplay, and it's also not necessary in order to win legendary Iron Man. I'm trying to showcase what you need to do in order to just replicate that. Get a nice little promotion. You always want to go with medical protocol into the medical route because it is simply better. for a vast number of reasons. Better action economy helps uh, people um, to, to overcome their mistakes, which oftentimes is the biggest reason why you're, uh, why you're struggling, making small mistakes here and there. Good, got another, got another specialist going. Unfortunately, we have a few tired soldiers, but we got one, two, three. We got three soldiers. Let's hope uh, that uh, the tired soldiers will be okay before the end of the month because that's where the first retaliation mission is going to kick in. Uh, could use another soldier, maybe. Avenger plotting new course. But wouldn't be able to get that one fast enough. Strategic resource located. Good, cool. Um, sure, let's get another soldier. <coughs> Might be just another squaddy, but why not? We do have enough intel elsewise, so we're actually okay. We we don't re we don't really need anything. Okay, we I could now go for the resistance ring. Alternatively, do we have anyone that is high enough? No, it's just corporals. 
All right, with it just being corporals, we can't get uh, the squad side upgrade yet. Hence, resistant ring is going in. Let's speed that uh, building process up. Or do I want to continue clearing here? You know, Resistance ring is nice, but just speed clearing is even nicer. This will prove to have been an important breakthrough, Commander. If we intend cool. Sword damage plus one, fantastic. We'll uh, next up, uh, we soon want to go for magnetic weapons, but before that happens, uh, there are a couple of interesting weapons that I would want to go for. So this year, um, this uh, here will allow us for armor upgrades soon, and this here will allow us for proving grounds and for PCSs. So we're starting with PCSs because uh, they will soon drop, and it's a free power grab. Cool. Let's take a look at our armory. Uh, one grenadier, one ranger, two specialists, uh, one sharpshooter. So what we can use at the beginning is cover removal. So what I would want to do is <coughs> get another grenadier. And there is the retaliation site that we've been talking about, Operation Witch Mother. That's going to happen the next uh, time. We could play it a bit risky um, and go in with um, just a Reaper Grenadier Specialist and then a Rookie. Or we're taking Anders for another, uh, for another trip accepting that he maybe gets shaken afterwards and has a mental uh, a mental problem for a while or gets wounded both might be fine we currently have a lot of power on the rangers the, uh, the sword plus one uh, breakthrough is helpful for him in particular the shotgun is good and rangers just generally are helping a lot at the beginning of the game. Uh, think about it whether or not I would want to go for it. Might not be a bad idea. Anyways, <coughs> that's all I've got uh, for today. Thank you uh, for watching. If you appreciate uh, the content, leave a comment and a like down below. That uh, always helps uh, the channel out. And see you on the next episode of this playthrough. Let's go, boys.